today I'm going to show you liquid eyeliner and the perfect way to achieve it. I actually, as a makeup artist, have a bit of a steady hand, so I've actually taught myself a great trick to get perfect Angelina Jolie eyeliner. When doing your liquid eyeliner, it's really important to know where you flick the end of the eye line. The rule is, imagine a line from the corner of your nose to the corner of the eye and up. So that's where we're going to put our sticky tape and use as a stencil. I can tell women who do eyeliner with their eyes closed because when you look at them you see all these lines. So keep your eyelids stretched. Load your brush up with lots of product. And you, what I'm actually going to do is angle my eye line straight from the sticky tape straight onto the eyelash line. The trick with liquid eyeliner is get it right into the eyelash bed. gently peel it off and you'll have a beautiful edge. That's how you get your edge. When you look straight into the mirror, you look at the highest part of your eye. And the highest part of your eye is where the eyeliner should be starting to thin right down. So, without confusing you, I've done my little flick and where her eye starts to round, I'm making that eye line thinner. And that's what gives us that straight, sexy eye line. So for straighter eyelids, you can go all the way across. The more rounded your eyelid, you have to actually start thinning it down the minute you get to the peak of your eye. Okay, again, applying sticky tape on the other eye. Just remember, corner of the nose, corner of the eye, and up. So start in the middle of your eye, and just go up onto the tape. You can also go back this way. You can choose between two types of eyeliner, a liquid or a shadow. Shadow is a little bit safer if you don't feel you have a steady hand, but if you're an expert, you can use liquid. I like to take the tape off quite quickly, because um, with some gel eyeliners, they'll actually get stuck on the tape. Okay, so you notice I've gone just halfway along, and now I'm gonna continue into the corner of the eye. The thicker you do your eyeliner in here, the thicker you have to do it on the outside and just do not look up until it's dry. 